Hello there and welcome to the Card Grotto. Today I have the new release from Clearly Pesotti to share with you. The new sets released today, 1st of September 2021 at 8pm at British Summer Time. You can purchase the sets as one big bundle exclusively from Clearly Pesotti or separately from Clearly Pesotti, Somerset Stamp, Card Nouveau, Art Creatu and Cloud9 Crafts. So as I usually do, I'm going to share the new sets with you and also the samples that I have made as a design team member. So the release is quite big this month so let's get started. This is the Meerkat Mischief set, <laughs> absolutely adorable. So you've got all of these different meerkats here and then the landscape and then you've got some fun sentiments that you can accompany the little meerkats. So things like all, I'll always look out for you, you can count on me, you are not alone, I've got your back, miss you, love from all of us, I'll always be there, just a really cute set, I love little meerkats. So this is the card that I made, I kept it fairly simple, I stamped out two of the meerkats, masked them off and then stamped out the kind of landscape below so that that one's sleeping on this kind of mound and then that one's standing up looking out for him which I just thought was really cute and I just did some really basic Copic colouring and then stamped out the, the sentiment there at the bottom. Next up is the Royal Corgi set, such a fun set. So you've got all of these cute little corgis here and then all of the different accompaniments that you can put with them. So you've got this one dressed up here with a little gown on and then you've got, I can never remember what they, these things are called, but the things that the Queen holds. And then you've got crowns that you can add on top. So you can create them like a Royal Corgi or you can have them as lots of different you know occasions or whatever you wanted really so you've got things like tea that you can have them to have um, afternoon tea you've got the teapot there with the union jack on you've got the castle there and just like fun accompaniments like a little um, cushion for them to sit on the little teacup some fun sentiments you've got meet me for tea drama queen spill the tea adjust your crown such a fun set Next up is the cleaning up set, another really fun set. So you've got all of these cute critters here that are doing all their different cleaning. And then you've got the background image here with the pile of clothes and the washing machine and the ironing board. You've got separate kind of clothes stacked up for laundry. Again, some fun sentiments, things like new home congratulations, a great big thank you for all you do. I'd be lost without you. You are truly appreciated. You can create some really fun scenes with that set. Next up is the Mythical Monsters set. So you've got all of these Mythical Monsters here, although to be honest with you, I think that most of them are real. <laughs> so you've got Bigfoot here, a griffin, I believe, a unicorn, a dragon, yeti and a Loch Ness monster. And then you've got this landscape here that you can have them in. I think you could use this for lots of different things actually, because this kind of piece here at the bottom, you could use that as water, but I think you could use that as ground or grass or anything like that to have the other critters on as well. Some really fun sentiments. You're so amazing is unbelievable. I believe in you. You're too good to be true. High five, believe in yourself. A really, like I said, fun set I think and actually I couldn't resist these critters so I did create two samples with this set this is the first one here with the yeti I just think he's absolutely adorable I stamped out that background but I only used the tree so I just fussy cut that out without a white border but you could probably mask it off if you wanted to but I just fussy cut it out so that I could have something behind the yeti and then for the background here I use this stencil this is the around about stencil and it's a really great stencil because you can basically make a circle um, but you can use the elements separately as well so you can have like this one would be the sky and then you can have like the kind of landscape in the middle the like cityscape or you can have that as the sky and then this is the ground lots of different ways that you can use it but I did just use this one here separately just for the sky because I wanted him to kind of sit on snow because I thought it'd be quite cute and then the sentiment there is from the tiny talk set and then this is the other sample that I made I made just a little tag here because I the Bigfoot he's just absolutely adorable I did the same thing with the tree there the tag is from the tag along set stamped out the sentiment there and then for the background I just used some distress inks and I used the cloudy day stencil for the sky there and just did some green for the grass 
Next up is the Alien Attack set. So I think this would be good for Halloween, but I also think it would be good just for general kind of fun cards. Monsters don't necessarily have to be just for Halloween, but they are all holding like little treat pots. So they are kind of more suited to Halloween, but I'm sure you could you know use them in different ways and then you've got this kind of haunted house type um, image there as well again some really fun sentiments fright night you're so sweet happy halloween little monster um pick me if um excuse me trick me if you have the guts have a monster boo to you just yeah a really really fun set Next up is the Simply Spellbound set. Again, I think you could probably use this for Halloween, but definitely more of a magical Harry Potter-esque type set. So you've got witches here with their witch's hat, one holding a book, one with the um, broomstick there. You've got the cauldron there and the kind of smoke coming out of the cauldron. And then I think these are wizards. I'm not 100% sure, but I think they're really cute with their capes on. And then you've got ones like holding wands and things like that. Some adorable, cute little owls. I absolutely love these. And then again, some great sentiments. I'll be there for you. Um, resting witch face. Um, witching you well. Back to school. Remember to spell check. Have a magical birthday. So I think this set could be used for lots of different occasions. I did actually colour in um, one of the little cats here with his cape on with the owls. Um, I just thought they were adorable but unfortunately I ran out of time to be able to make a card with them but hopefully I will manage to do that soon. Next up is the Frightening Friends set, another really fun Halloween set. So you've got all of these cute critters dressed up. They've got the witch there and the ghost. Um, the little mummy, the uh, the mummy, excuse me, and then the spider there, just some really, really cute images. And you've got the pumpkin house there as well that they could be next to. You can use that separately. You can use the critters on their own. Really versatile set for Halloween. Again, some fun sentiments. You're wickedly cute. You're beautiful. Uh, treat yourself. Have a wicked Halloween. Happy haunting. Bite me. Really, really fun. So this is the card that I made using that set, stamped out the pumpkin house and the little cat there with her um, witch's hat and the broomstick, coloured those with Copic markers and fussy cut those out with scissors, did some distress inking in the background, splattered on a load of black gouache and then the sentiment there is from the says it all again set, I thought the kind of best witches worked well with the little witch there. Next up is the Picture It Castle, another fun set that I think can be used for loads of different occasions and also be accompanied with loads of different images as well. So you've got this really lovely castle with the kind of landscape here. You could use that as a new home. A lot of these sentiments here are kind of new home based, but I think you, like I said, use it for lots of different occasions. Um, you've got things like new home, adjust your crown, you've got this. So you could add one of those little corgis, I think would be really cute. Um, one or two or three or four, you know, um, onto the scene again with, or you could have things flying, one of the dragons maybe flying more, you know, I think you could use this, like I said, for loads of different um, occasions. I didn't get a chance to use it unfortunately but um, I am looking forward to trying this one out. Next up is the Sweet Dreams set with three Zs. Another great versatile set because I think you can use a lot of these image with images with lots of other images and I could, like mix and match different sets and things like that. So you've got all of these lovely clouds. The one with the rainbow here in the clouds, you've got clouds with stars on you've got the moon there a really lovely kind of heart triple heart and then you've got these most adorable little ponies that can be sleeping on the clouds or on the moon inside the heart again I think you could use those with different things as well again mix and match lots of different critters for different kind of sky scenes and things like that some lovely sentiments hope you have a magical day love you wish big may all your dreams come true I just think this is such a sweet little set this is the card I made with it. I stamped out one of the little ponies there 
masked her off and then stamped out the moon so that she was sleeping on the moon did some distress ink in the background with the cloudy day stencil again added some little white um, gel pen stars there the sentiment is from the tiny talk set no I do apologize it's from the chitter chatter set I love that set as well and I thought the thinking of you worked quite nicely with her kind of uh, sleeping on the moon there and last but not least, this is the Tricky Treats set with three Zs as well. So you've got all of these adorable um, sloths here all dressed up for Halloween a lot of them are sleeping on the job because that's what sloths do so you've got like the mummy there again with the toilet paper um so so fun you've got the one with the witch there the one sort of hanging from the garland the, the ones with the pumpkins and things like that in the sweets pile so so cute again some fun sentiments treats not tricks please trick or treats and <laughs> um, without you I'm hollow inside wake me up when it's Halloween you snooze you lose treats treats and I thought I would just create a cute little tag with the little witchy one there uh, sleeping on her broomstick so I did some distress inking on in the background this is another tag along tag with a kind of different top I love this scallop scalloped top masked off a moon there just colored that with Copic markers I did the little kind of sleeping zeds there just a really kind of cute little tag that I thought I could add on to a card for Halloween or I could add on to like a little treat bag or something like that so that that was the new release from Clearly Posotted for September 2021. I would love to hear your thoughts on the release. Like I said, all of the products will be released at 8 p.m. tonight. That's British summertime. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you soon.